Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is July 11th of 2019, and it is, what day? Thursday. I'm retired, so I never know what day it is. I usually don't even know what time it is. Uh, I haven't made a YouTube video in over a week, so I need to, I need to do that. Um, This, this is kind of scary here. Iranian boats attempt to seize a British oil tanker. Uh, and it looks like millions are bracing for storms. It could make a landfall as hurricanes. Like I said, I'm in Fort Worth, Texas. We had a... Uh, some really... Big thunderstorm last le yesterday <coughs> afternoon and evening. I think we were sort of on the edge of the uh, rain, but the thunder was just uh, the first time it uh, thunder happened. I jumped. I thought something. You know, <coughs> we're right near an air base. Uh, so if, when that first I went because I didn't know we were. In fact, I didn't know we were had some. Uh, bad weather coming. Um, this video, I am going to... Well, I want to mention this. Um, maybe tip you off. I am... This is my Panasonic G7 camera. Which, well, let's go to... I'm going to, I think, sell it on eBay. Actually, I was going to sell it back to Amazon and the, well let me show you on that too that's you can jump in here maybe telling what tell me what I'm doing wrong Amazon well, let me go to orders here first okay G7 I think I can just put no I all I have to do is put in uh, to put in camera that's what I can do okay here it is okay I ordered it uh, well I ordered that in uh, December 6th of 2017 I it's met condition I haven't also, I got it with a 14 by 42 lens. And the reason, I, well, that's sort of much the, the uh, standard way. But uh, I got it for making YouTube videos. And you'll find YouTube videos on here. A few, not very many. Because, uh, so the lens is perfect for, you know, YouTube videos. But I was thinking about getting a 14 by 140 but I don't want you know so I'm actually just thinking of selling it on eBay but first okay I was going to sell it take a look at this go down here and it shows you that um, okay so it's about five hundred dollars um okay okay sell on Amazon. So I thought I would just sell it back to Amazon. Okay. Now you're going to see this message. Okay. <clears throat> we noticed that it's been a while since you had any transactions on your Amazon seller account associated with your email address. Because of the inactivity, we've closed this seller account. Your buyer account is not affected. We appreciate that you choose Amazon as a selling channel. And we're delighted to see you return. When you're ready, simply register a new account. Okay. I'm clicking on register new account. And then it sends me back to this place. And I try different things. You know, the other day I just deleted uh, Chrome browser. I got a feeling that that's, that if I tried to use a Chrome browser, maybe it would work. But I uh, 
because this is the development version of uh, uh, what do you call it the uh, new windows thing now here's their internet explorer or oh okay now this is microsoft edge explorer uh, development okay this is microsoft edge regular i tried that same i get the same message and i tried foxfire i i just don't want to install chrome again i'm trying to is uh you know remove some things and clean up a little bit on this stuff and so anyway that's what i'm getting so i guess i'll have to sell the camera on uh ebay I don't remember actually selling a camera back or selling anything back. But I guess I did. I don't remember selling anything back through Amazon, but I was going to rather than eBay. Um, okay, the other, well, let me follow along here. Let me do this. Um, let me go to eBay. Okay. Okay, um, here is the camera, by the way. I mean, this is the G7 because I was here the other day looking to see what they're selling for used. Uh, and this is, seems to be about it, $399 uh, for, for the camera. So I'm thinking of selling... The reason, I mean, it's a fantastic camera. I mean, it was a dream camera, and I uh, I got it. I love it, but I haven't spent any time uh, really learning to use it. And um, also, since I don't have, let's, let me enter in here some more Panasonic G7 and do a search here. So you can get an idea of, you know, here's other ones that are selling. Now this one here is brand new down here. Um, this one they say is an open box up here, $4.99. Uh, so you get an idea about what they sell for. Uh, the other re one, I don't want to buy another lens. Uh, and I mentioned that when I, if you look back at my videos, you'll see, I'm going to buy this. I'm not going to buy another lens. Now I'm thinking about buying another lens. But the problem for me is uh, we don't have a car. If I had a car, you know, I'd have my camera in a camera bag and I just throw it in the car and it would be with me be available or whatever but I don't have a car um, now this camera I really love uh, I'll keep this of course this is the LX7 Panasonic LX7 and uh, it is really it's a great cam you know it fits in my pocket. I've made, you'll see YouTube videos also that I've made with, you know, with this walking and talking or whatever. And this is my uh, FZ200, Panasonic FZ200, and has a f2.8 lens. And the zoom on this is, where is the zoom? But it's on the lens. Well, let's. I mean, let me go back to Amazon. Now, of course, this one is also, but it has a great telephoto on it. But um, I'm going to keep it, of course. Oops, Amazon. Let's see. That's where I want to go. Okay, F. I said an FC80. Of course, I'd like to have an, let's see, FZ.
I'd like to have the later, you know, have a later model of, uh, here's the FZ80, and it's, it's only $300. Um, okay, it has a 60x zoom. Um, let's see, here is FZ80 4K. Okay, okay, mine is not, this is not 4K, I don't believe. I think this is the FZ80, and I do not believe it is 4K, which really, but. Let's see. Anyway, I'm going to keep this because of the zoom lens. If I ever go to the zoo or go to a beach or something or other, I want this and I'll be carrying it in a bag or whatever. So that's a keeper. This is a keeper. Although I would love to go to, this is the LX7. Panasonic LX7. I think they're up to 10. Whoops, I put LX70, okay. What did I want, LX10. Okay. Okay, here's the LX10. Uh, I just can't go, you know, the um, $500 for, I think I'll just stick with this, but anyway, I mean, I'm sticking with it, but so, um, okay, what I wanted to tell you about was Oh, I think I was going to show you. Why did I? Okay. Uh, I'm thinking of putting in this G7 camera and selling it on my eBay place. Here's my cherry shrimp. Well, these are not, you know, I bought them from an eBay site. These are not the, uh, but... If I get a picture of my uh, shrimp uh, easily or whatever, and, uh, I may uh, include that at the end of this video. Um, oh, okay, my account, eBay. Uh, let's see. I actually don't do eBay. I mean, I did it a long time. I've done it a few times. I only do it if I'm selling a radio or a camera or something. But my ex-wife used my used the account for uh, selling the stuff that she was selling on there. So I'm not even, uh, I might say, summary, recent views, bids, watch list, purchase history. Purchase history is going to show you the... Uh, Stuff that I bought for the, here they are. I bought uh, for $26 uh, 10 red cherry shrimp. I bought uh, on eBay, I bought this plant. I bought these three snails. I bought this plant. Okay. But let's see, sell. How come it doesn't show, let's see, account settings. Well, here, I guess if I go here, this will take you, no, it's go, well, okay, yeah. Let's see, I have 32 positive, uh, no neutral, and no negatives. Okay, here you can see what the ex-wife has been selling. Items for sale. I guess that's the only thing she has on here now for sale. She's pretty much stopped doing uh, eBay stuff after... My God, I got her a computer a long time ago. After Right after we were divorced or whatever, she was going to art... Show, or to art... Uh, 
places to sell her artwork and do stuff like that. And I told her, hey, you should be in. I got her a computer. And uh, my kids showed that were living with her showed her how to set it up and do that kind of stuff and whatever. I guess my eBay is going to show up. Let's see if I do my eBay. Let's see. Yeah, there's very little on here. Um, sales for the last 12 months, $470. Anyway, I will, if I decide, if I, I'm not sure, I'm not going to decide today about this, uh, about this camera. Um, I'm not sure what you can see. Uh, uh, if I decide to put it on eBay here in the next few days or whatever, I'll put a link in case somebody wants, in case one of you want to buy it through eBay. Um, I wonder if any of you have a LX10 or you want to, and you want to trade? Nah, I'll just go ahead and sell it. I'll just sell this G7. Um, oh, okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to make a video showing you how you can... And I'll make it a separate video. Because people complain. Eh, not much. I don't get any complaints. But people do. They want to find something that I'm jabbering about something else. So I'm going, to make, I'm going to stop here in a little bit and going to make a video and I'll show you how that you can order groceries from Walmart and have them delivered. And I will give you a coupon number or whatever, a link. If you use that link and you spend, I think it's $40, minimum you will get ten dollar a number for ten dollars off that you can enter and uh, when you you'll get ten dollars off your order I will also get ten dollars so uh, off on an order so I'll set a thing up and because you can't, uh, let's see here. You, you Now here, and I think it's gonna vary, may not be available everywhere in the United States. It is here in Dallas, Fort Worth, of course, and just about every place else that you can get their groceries. Um, I think that they use different services for the delivery. And I forget the name of the, uh, Oh, what is it? Can't remember. Doesn't matter, but they don't use their the vans that they maybe they don't have the vans in your area. Here in this area, they have they have big vans, but that's what they deliver the. Uh, wait, nope, that's that's Amazon. I'm getting these confused, mixed up. So I'm talking about uh, Walmart ordering food from Walmart. So. Uh, let me see if I can log into Walmart. I don't think you can. Actually, my ex-wife does the. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can log into Walmart.com. Okay, here it is. So it is here. So they have pickup service and they they also have delivery service. So I'm guess I'm guessing I'm guessing that uh, some places probably in the United States you cannot get it delivered to you, and some places you can. And uh, anyway, we have now it went first, Jordash. That's not Jordash. What is it? Something Dash is what they're using in this area to uh, do the delivery. So it's those 
like Uber, except it's uh, for the, so we tried to find, you know, we logged into the Walmart site and tried to find a way to place an order and we couldn't find any way to place the order. Then we called uh, a Walmart and said, uh, you know, do you deliver? And I said, no, we don't deliver. Called another one. They said, uh, oh yeah, we deliver, but uh, something dash does the delivery service and that's, you know, private individuals or whatever. So, and eventually, so finally we got, figured it out. And uh, let's see, start an order. Pick up, pick up the order today. Okay, I don't want to pick up. I want to delivering. Okay, well, let's see if I click on start an order. James delivered your groceries on Friday, July 5th. Care to tip? It's completely optional. I usually tip, but I'm not going to tip right now because I thought we already did. Okay. Okay. Okay, here it is. So here, you can see my address up here where you can deliver, have it delivered. Uh, and then here's, they have just about everything that they have in the grocery store. So, um, says down here, I see $30. See, my ex-wife's the one that knows about this. Uh, $30 minimum. We usually order, um, uh, five, six, or seven 24 packs of Coke Zero. Anyway, it's a good deal. By the way, this, uh, Zataran or whatever, all of their products are excellent, uh, been buying that stuff for a long time and uh, but Walmart's grocery pickup and delivery da, 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 da. let's see your account details okay I'm afraid to press this and I'll tell them what it's going to show what I want is the code to give to you. Well, let me do this. Um, oh, okay. So I want to start a separate video anyway. So I'm going to stop and then come back and make a video just on this. And then I'll give you the code that you can enter where you can order groceries, have it delivered to you, or you can go pick it up. Um, well, I'm not sure if they, if you can't remember that well. Uh, I'm not sure if you get the 10 for the first order, the $10, uh, probably you do. But I know for the delivery, because we already did that. Um, so I'm going to stop, come back, and make this, uh, this video. So thank you very much for watching.